one very important goal would be to prevent MS. But on the, on the flip side, you know, if someone does develop MS, there, there are things we can do to limit its consequences and its effect. And we have much more traction from that perspective. So, um, you know, this is an era of MS treatment where our, our treatments for relapsing um, forms of the disease are excellent. Um, and, you know, the next frontier is kind of how we, you know, how we repair damage that's been done and how we slow the progression of damage. And, and there is a lot of very exciting research in the pipeline there. Um, I, I think that, you know, our goal should be to kind of target those things in parallel, you know, study how we can prevent it, but understanding that, you know, that may not be possible in a short interval of time. And so how do we kind of prevent it from, you know, from progressing? How do we repair the damage that's been done? Um, and so what I, what I try to um, convey to, to some of my patients is if you think about other conditions, you know, that are chronic, you know, if it's diabetes or high blood pressure, you know, these are things that we, we you know, can't necessarily make go away, but, you know, we can, we can treat them to the extent that they're, you know, in, in the back burner of your life and, and not, you know, having consequences for you. And so I think that is an equally important goal. And, and there's a lot of exciting research and a lot of advancement going on in, in that sense.